So it's been about three weeks since my last video I did on Rod AI. And at the time of that video, as you can see, the market cap was around 119 million. They had around 1300 holders. Now, since then, Rod AI hit an all time high, a little bit over 8 million. It has retraced since then, bounced off a little bit of support and now trying to build that support Why it looks for that next leg up now there's a few things we're going to cover in this video that's taken place since that first video i did on rod ai now a lot of people are asking mike do you still like rod ai do you still hold rod ai the question is yes but remember just because i hold something doesn't mean you should potentially hold it remember i'm always giving you information to help you make a good decision for yourself i'm never telling you to buy hold or sell but i definitely like the potential that rod ai has as well now if we look at the current chart here you can see on dex tools here's that current all-time high it was a little bit over 8 million as you can see retrace since then bounced off of this line of support and now it's trying to consolidate a little bit as we look for that next leg up to retest that current all-time high now as you can see the current market cap is 1.9 million and as you can see the holders has almost tripled so if we go back over to this video three weeks ago as you can see the holders was only 1300 but now today you can see over 3800 so almost triple and the reason why i really like this is the fact is even though this market cap isn't a massive amount higher than what it was three weeks ago we've almost tripled the amount of holders which means there's a good distribution among the tokens among every single holder of rod ai which means we don't have to worry about a ton of massive whales waiting to dump on us right so this is definitely something you want to see now one of the first things i want to share with you regarding rod ai they are now listed on one of the top 15 largest and well-known exchanges which is mexc as you can see right here on this tweet we are thrilled to announce that rod ai kickstarter has concluded and rod ai will be listed on mexc and you can see this took place uh march 30th of last month and if you go over to coin market cap here here are the current markets so if you're looking to purchase this the decentralized way you're going to have to use radium or jupiter and if you're looking to use the centralized way the only exchange is currently on right now is mexc and you will be able to use usdt to purchase it all right so the next thing i want to show you is one of their partnerships that they announced which is we are excited to announce our partnership with rod ai the innovative community driven project the groundbreaking rocket ecosystem on solana the rod kit will streamline token creation and community growth while rod ai evolves into a real world utility now cls global the reason why i thought this was interesting is because this is the same marketing team that floki used and last cycle floki was the third largest meme coin in all of crypto and so not saying that rod, rod ai is going to become the third largest you know meme coin but the fact that they're using the same marketing team which means they can potentially get some of that success as well. Now, the next thing I wanna show you is their liquidity announcement. And I actually announced this or talked about their liquidity uh, coming uh, basically available in the first video I did with Rod AI. They basically locked their liquidity for 30 more years, which is just massive. Now, I'm not gonna read this whole tweet here, but if we move down, you can see right here, event of april 1st 2024 is complete and the lp tokens have been relocked for 30 years this is not an april fool's joke but now instead of uh april 2024 it's going to be april 1st 2054 you can click on that link to verify that as well but the fact that the project has locked the liquidity for 30 years shows commitment and shows that this project really wants this project to succeed and again if we just look at everything that they've already accomplished since the last video i put out the new marketing team the new mexc listing locking the, uh, the liquidity for 30 years and then last but not least is the roadmap for rod kit which is pretty awesome now i'm not going to go through all of this but i am going to you know kind of pause the screen here so you can kind of see this for yourself now you can see the check marks are pretty much by all of these except for the last four here which is tokenomic setup roadmap setup 
frequently asked questions section creation and then automated website generation tool so this is literally going to be a one-stop shop for people to completely create their own token they're going to have support when it comes to everything for them with ai functions and if we move down a little bit you have the community engagement, you have the marketplace, you have professional services, you have listing support, and then you have other utilities as well, including token lock. So this thing is going to be very interesting uh, to see how this all unfolds. And if you look right here, it says the target date is April 5th of this year which is a couple of days from now this is the target date not guaranteed but this is the target date so again really looking forward to see how all of this is going to unfold again this is not just a meme coin this is a meme coin with utility and with ai functions to it and so again if this rock kit can catch this thing can really uh, be explosive for rod ai especially if you're getting in around these price levels because we already saw it take off before and when it moves it moves pretty quick so let me know down in the comment section are you still holding rod ar are you looking forward to the rod kit their toolkit that's coming out what do you think about their mex listing also what do you think about them locking the liquidity for 30 years i think that's big and it shows a lot of commitment so let me know down in the comment section on what we covered in this video i would love to hear it, and i will catch you all on the next one